Hey, what's up? We uh, made it to Whale K, two day sail from Bimini. On our way to Nassau. Yep, next stop is Nassau. Just walked up to that uh, lighthouse. lighthouse over there. But, uh, over. I can't see it now. Over there? Right there. <laughs> but, uh, That's not it. Just checking in with everybody. Hope everybody's doing good, but uh, look, look, look at what we have as far as the beach here. It's pretty darn birdie. All right, talk to you guys later. Hey, sweetie, where are we going this morning? Hey, we're going to be pigs on Big Major Island. Nice. Nice little dinghy ride. Where we got to go through right there? What is that? Fast channel cut. A little cut? With some current. That's yeah, like uh, 50 feet. Wide. 50 feet wide. Cool. All right, we're going to go check it out. Stay tuned. Times is that? Twice in two days. <laughs> you were worried about mine. Another successful rescue of the hat. <laughs> Dang. Aren't you glad you brought me along? Yes, that's all I got you here for. You know that? Hey now. All you right. Might starve otherwise. All right, where are we going, hon? Feed the pigs. Again. All right. Yes. So what'd you think of the piggies? Well, it was like being on the farm again, except with a lot of sand. So, it was fun. The babies were adorable. Cool. It was fun. And of course you had to get your farm girl stuff in. You had to give them some water. Of course. They had no water. I had to feed them veggies. They didn't have any water. So None so at all. didn't take care of them yesterday, so. Yeah. So, fed them some water. But, uh, you can see here, we're, uh, it's quite the busy spot. Yep, on the other side of the rocks, between the that little cut. The mast on the right? Yep, mast on the right. That's her. And then look at this anchorage out here. Look at all these guys. And of course there's the uh, sport the mega yacht. But yeah, they got a little bit of rock and roll. Um, We're getting zero. And we got zero. So, little dinghy ride's probably about a mile, right? About a mile ride? 
half mile from our boat. But uh, All right, cool. Babe. All right. fun. So beautiful day. Figure we'd uh, try to catch up on some laundry. But the problem is, look what shows up. Hopefully you can see that, but uh, that is a storm cloud. And there's Miss Michelle over there, hanging up what we got as far as laundry. And, uh, but if we could just uh, keep that weather over there, not this weather over here. No, no likey. Anyway, guess we'll be taking the laundry down. Yep, it rained. What do you think? Rain, 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 rain. I did get out and clean the top of the boat though. I don't even know if you can hear me. It's raining so hard. But uh, there it is. It is raining, 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 raining. Oh well, uh, life in the truck. Hey, Catalina 42 owners. Just a little maintenance tip. Um, please check your engine through holes. Your generator through holes, check the hose clamps. Um, the hose clamps didn't look that bad. Um, had some kind of uh, rust surfaces on them. Um, I figured I'd replace them anyways no matter what, but uh, I just unscrewed them and they snapped. I had two of them break and then the other ones too, so this is what it's supposed to look like. It's a nice, clean, brand new. But uh, just a word of advice, please, everybody, check their through-hole hose clamps. Um, I know these are less than two years old, so it's very important. Um, I'd say it's probably because of uh, it is the strainer. Um, I have to clean the strainers quite often with some type of debris getting in as we travel. Um, but uh, please check them. Just a word of advice. Hey, we're gonna do the grotto here in front of Stanley Key. Gonna go swim in the water. So in a cave. In a cave. Even though I'm claustrophobic. All right, we'll see how it works out. I'm gonna send him in first. Okay. All right. Bye.
you doing, Shell? Hey, pulling up, the, pulling up the anchor. Oh, did you have a good time in the grotto? No, it was a good time. Did you? Oh yeah, sure did. Boy, that current was strong though. Awesome, it was. All right, all right, good deal. Well, let's head back to the boat. Yeah, thanks for taking me. It was fun. All right. All right, we're back to Bell. Let's watch Miss Graceful here get in. Good job. <laughs> Not bad. All right, good times. We're home. Here we are sailing in the Bahamas. Just putzing along. Sails out.
if you live on a sailboat and you travel, the boat moves all the time. And when it moves, your books fall on the ground. That's where the books are supposed to stay. But as we travel, they end up falling, end up all over the ground. Now, usually, all of them fall. So it wasn't that bad of a trip this time. So we're working on a plan to... So Michelle has sewn these, which is a... They're clipped into the wall right here. It works as you just unroll it. And you clip those in like that. fall out so there's one installed here's the other one that we need to install over there So here is the finished installed product and we're hoping that the books will not fall down. And yes, we have fans everywhere. Yeah, well we finished that project. The Lee Cloth book control is complete. Uh, it's a few hours later, it's dark outside. Um, we had to run to town. We're anchored out in the middle of uh, Clarence Town Harbor, South Bahamas, uh, Long Island. And um, anchored out here, so we had to go to town, get some pictures of uh, downtown. Um, if you are on Instagram, go, go to Instagram. Check out SV Bell 2004. That's SV Bell 2004. And many pictures on there, also on uh, my Facebook page. But uh, well, it's living the dream. It's all done. And. Um, Need a consensus too on on my hair. Should I keep letting it grow or should I cut it? Anyway. Projects on a boat in the middle of the ocean. Gotta do it. See you guys.